right. Has there been any significant changes to the roster, coaches, facilities? What significant changes have happened in the past six months? Uh, a couple of changes have been. We're probably going to add a couple new coaches uh, going forward. One or two have moved on, which is pretty typical in high school football. But our coordinators are all here, and, and a lot of guys that, that have been here for years are still with the program. Some of the changes are we've ordered new uniforms, ones that the guys have picked out and, and we're really excited about. It. They fundraise hard to earn these jerseys, and we think they'll be a great addition to what we look like on the field. We've also uh, had a lot of great parents step up and create new committees that help our program going forward. Okay. What are your thoughts on the upcoming season? Well, we're excited about it. It's getting ready to begin with our summer workouts. We have guys doing 21-man workouts right now. We think we have a lot of great young guys um, looking to step in on the offensive side of the ball and, and assume some positions of guys that graduated. On the defensive side of the ball, we feel we have some guys that have moved in um, to the area that we didn't even know were showing up that have great additions. We have some guys that have been here working hard for the last 18 months that we've been here, and we feel we have a good chance to be successful there. Uh, special team-wise, we have our punter returning, our kicker returning, Long snappers returning, uh, punt returns returning, kick returns returning. So we have a lot of guys there that can make a difference. But outlook for the seasons, we don't look past today. We just try to go from day to day and win everything we do. Uh, with your team being relatively young, what, if anything, has been encouraging that you've seen from uh, the players, either the veterans or the young players that are new to the team? We've had some guys that are veterans step up, be leaders. Um, Jay Shuler's done a great job. Josh Hunter's done a great job. And there's a bunch that's done a great job day in and day out trying to lead the program. Uh, we're really excited about the young guys that have bought in, have started to develop that, that hard work, that ethic, that work ethic that we want to be successful. We feel we have a bunch of them that are really kind of growing up day by day. We're excited for them. Okay, the schedule is out. Uh, besides the, the new non-conference slate, and uh, with Fuquay being a rival and Holly Springs being on the rise, is there any games that y'all circled as soon as the uh, schedule came out that you're looking forward to? Uh, we don't circle any of them. We circle all of them. But we focus on the first one first, and, and that's going to be, I believe, Garner. So we're worried about beating Garner. But before that, we've got to be really good at practice. We've got to be great at 7-on-7. Seven seven. We've got to be great at one-on-one -on -one drills and individual drills. And if we do that, then every game becomes relevant. And that's our goal, ultimately. What do you have to say to the fans and the parents and the students? We've Middle Creek is, uh, has a record of winning a lot of conference titles. They're almost a, a lot to win every year. What's what's the next step? Are y'all content with just winning that, or are we looking for bigger things? We uh, we're not content uh, on winning conference titles. We're not content on going eleven and zero. We're content on going one and zero. If you go one and zero every day, ultimately you win the last game of the year. If you win the last game of the year, next thing you know you're champions. That's what we want to be. And, and to our fans and, and to the parents and to the players, hard work achieves that. And we appreciate their support in trying to achieve that. Uh, last thing, what's, what's the model going to the new year? Every time there's new year, you're going to have new jerseys and new players, new coaches, new faces, new mindset. What's the model going into the new year? We believe in going one and up, winning everything we do day to day, whether it be the classroom, study hall, uh, practice, film sessions, weight room, everything. Go one and up. And the other thing is, you know, success is it's achieved. It's, it's earned. It's not given. Any last thoughts that you want to let everybody aware of? Uh, we appreciate all support. We look forward to seeing everybody this season, and uh, hopefully we make it a great one for you. You can come in.